The National Audit Office of Estonia has audited mining resources on a number of occasions, be it peat, building materials, or oil shale. All of these have been environmental audits and have analyzed the sustainability aspect of mining, among other things. In the course materials, there is an example audit entitled National Organization of Mining of Mineral Resources Used in Construction. Tuli, you are the audit leader. Tell me, what's the most important thing when it comes to the sustainability of mining resources? We focused in the audit on the planning and supervision of resource mining. In Estonia, sustainable development law stipulates that the government must establish limits on the excavation of mineral resources. These limits help ensure that not too many mines are opened and that the mines are not too tightly packed in one area. What criteria did you use in the audit? We used three sets of audit criteria to evaluate the sustainability of mining. First, we looked into whether the government had decided how long natural resources should last and whether excavation limits had been set accordingly. Then we analysed whether the feasibility and necessity of opening mines in specific locations had been analysed during national, county and local government planning procedures. Finally, we checked whether all relevant aspects of environmental, economic and social impact were taken into account when issuing the mining permits. What was the end conclusion? Is the mining of building materials sustainable in Estonia? Unfortunately, this is not the case, at least uh, not according to the audit we did in 2009. Uh, that's the conclusion uh, we reached because there were no annual usage limits and the opening of new mines was dependent solely on business interests. Plus, supervision over mining activities was insufficient. Mm -hmm.